they were desperate for a son. So after 60 years of trying, they got one. This couple used in vitro fertilization and like in so many assisted pregnancies, got twins. Some would say they should be pleased. But then, take a look at this. One of the children is a baby girl, so they don't want her. The 70 plus couple who are grandparents wanted a boy and only a boy who would be their heir. Imagine how their daughters feel. Joy in this house at the birth of a son after more than 60 years. The mother is 70, father 76. But no one seems to be giving that a second thought. For them, there's a lot to cheer. Their heir is here. Charan Singh and his wife have two daughters and are grandparents of six children. But the couple still wanted a son. Their prayers were answered when a doctor guaranteed them a son for nearly three lakhs. As in most fertility treatments, they ended up having twins, a boy and a girl. Their third daughter and certainly not what they ordered. 70-year-old Omkali has been giving interviews after she gave birth to twins at the age of 70. This family had lost all hope when Dr. Shashi assured them that Omkali will have only sons. Now they're happy that they have a son to take care of the property and the relatives, but also a daughter they didn't need. Omkali and Charan Singh feel they have been cheated. <laughs> The case brings the spotlight back on the need to monitor assisted pregnancies and the lengths to which some couples go to for a boy, even in the 21st century. Omkali's doctors, however, say it is nothing short of a medical breakthrough. Even I have seen it first time. This is, it looks like a miracle. This is unexpected to us. Omkali and Charan Singh are overjoyed to have a son at last. But how many more years do they have? With Anchal Vora, Manu Sharma for NDTV.